Good morning, Carter's Life. We are driving my fire truck across the country over 500 miles. This is day number three. Last night, we stayed at the Sheriff Fam house with my parents and baby Otter. This is the final leg of the journey and also the longest. Good morning, we got the rat pack, a good night of sleep, and we're gonna be ready for the final haul. Otter, what are you eating? Is that a carrot? Okay. It was really nice to be back home at the Sheriff M house, but we have a long trip ahead of us, so it's time to hit the road. He's gonna put a steering servo in there, and make it an RC car. Straight shot. Just about 12 hours here at the Sheriff M house. I'm packed up and I'm ready to go. We're gonna go to the Team Rar house, which is our longest leg. I think it's 285 miles south. So it's gonna be crazy. I'm already so exhausted. Can't wait to get home and probably sleep all day tomorrow if I can. Honestly, it feels like I'm walking out to the end of the driveway waiting for the school bus like I did back in elementary school, waiting for the school bus right here. Some years we waited right over there. And I'm just waiting for the big old school bus. Come pick me up. I'm ready for school. <laughs> I got my Team Rar backpack. Let's go to vlog school. <laughs> Like the good old days. Yeah. Then at the bus stop. Oh, is that the school bus? Ah, oh, there he is. There he is. Yes. Look at that thing. It's so big. The school bus is here. All right, guys. It literally feels like I'm catching the bus back in elementary school. This is so cool. It's about the same size as a school bus. Honestly, it's probably bigger. It only got two seats in the front. <laughs> good morning. The school bus is here. <laughs> That's literally what I was saying. <laughs> okay, Mom. All right, have a good Final trip. haul. All right. Keep me posted yeah. when you get home. It's been I can't wait for the next surprise. I wonder what that'll be. Uh oh. -uh. <laughs> bye, Mom. <laughs> and we're off. Saying bye to my mom, the Sheriff M house. Riding like a true firefighter. Okay, so it's actually way off. It's not 180 miles, it's 250 miles. That is uh, a lot more than I thought, but we are gonna just keep pushing on. While we're driving home, I got a text from Andrew at the Team Raw house saying that the new Team Raw gate is being installed right now. So that's another incentive to get this fire truck home. If this flipped down, probably because of the bumps, and this is slowly coming out, and we're not able to adjust that, so hopefully it doesn't become a bigger problem. Oh, the gas is on the other side. I was looking for the gas. There it is. <laughs> diesel only. Diesel and diesel exhaust fluid. Air ride seat can crusher. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Oh. This is so stupid. Wow. So we're checking the height of how tall we are because we are a tall fire truck. But compared to your standard run of the mill semi truck, it's hard to see, but I put the camera here. I don't know, it's hard to see either way. Yeah, we're like a foot shorter, so as far as hitting stuff, I think we should be okay. And we have been, so. Well, the next leg of today is 100 miles to our next stop, and then probably about 70 more after that. She'll need a good old wash. I think all this will come right off, though. Yeah, that'll come right rain. off. Yeah. She'll spruce up quite well. We're waiting at this light. This truck in front of us has been here for like three light cycles. Everyone behind us is honking the horn. Like, er, 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 like what are you doing? Everything's backing up. It's backing up this way. It's backing up behind us. All of these trucks, as far as you can see, just because there's one guy. I don't know if he fell asleep. I don't know if he's having truck problems. I don't know what's going on. It's really weird. He has his blinker on. He didn't throw his hazards on, which is what I imagine he would do if he broke what down. Is this is so weird. Maybe he fell asleep. Maybe he's having truck problems. I don't know. 
really odd, <laughs> but all these truckers are getting very upset. Oh my god. Now he goes? What do you think he was doing? I don't know. I have no theories. People are so upset with this guy. That was weird. Is he gonna cut us off now? No way. And he cuts us off? Okay, something ain't right. I think he's on his phone trying to figure out where to go. He's taking liberties. Blocking up traffic. I think so. That's my best guess. I think he was just being rude. And then on top of that, swerves and cuts in front of us. And we're a fire truck, and everyone thinks we're real firefighters driving a real fire truck. It doesn't make sense. Don't be that guy. So far, this leg of the trip has been really smooth. The fire truck is going pretty slow and we're taking it nice and easy. Driving this thing on the highway is definitely scary. We don't want to push our limits. All right, we are now approaching Richmond. We're going up a crazy looking bridge. Beautiful sight of all the green, lush southern trees. Love that. Really cool bridge. Yeah, beautiful bridge over a beautiful river and a fire truck. Woo! Yeah. Your head yeah. down. <laughs> you have I mean, to. I smacked my head so bad last time. Oh, there is no cushion. Oh, I hit my head so hard. Oh my gosh. We made great progress today, and this is time for our last gas station stop. This is really exciting stop, guys. Because we're going to Simmons. Woo! But seriously, it's exciting because this is our last stop, our last fill up. And the next time we're going to Team Warehouse, and it's actually a really surprising surprise for us at this Team Warehouse right now that I'm gonna see for the first time when we get home. And I think we're gonna beat Sunset, so we'll be able to vlog it. Boom! Yep. Ah, oh, I love that. Yep. Like air brakes on a fire truck. Oh, stretch them legs. Unbelievable. 
here's the surprise. Oh my gosh. Oh, my butt hurts, I'll tell you that much. Oh, that was a long, bumpy ride. <laughs> now this is a fire truck right here. It's big. It's hard to believe that you, uh, you made it. Yeah, 500 and some miles with one new tire. And the new one's looking a little low. It's kind of yeah, I'm hoping that's just because they're sitting on a, on a slant. But all the tires made it this time. Yep. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, look at this, Matt. Oh, another one. Oh, oh another roar awesome. monster. Yeah. Talk about a surprise. The Grand Gates. Let's run. First time it's off-roading at the Team Rar house. Going around the brand new, not even fully installed yet, gate. Let's see if this thing, I might break the driveway. Let's see if this thing is so heavy. Let's see, is it gonna crack it? So far, so good. That one was drug there. Oh, it definitely squished the pavement, though. Man, that thing is heavy. Oh, he better get back on. Oh, no. Now that we've made it home 500 miles, I gotta celebrate by climbing back up, going to the cab, and riding up here for the first time. It's a little slanted because of the hydraulics. There's Matt. All right. Talk about a cab over truck. Look at the view from up here, yes. Oh gosh, that's scary. Uh, I thought he was gonna hit. We got the trees, yes. This is so cool, yeah. Oh man, this thing has got to be bigger and taller than the other truck. Oh, we are coming real close. Oh, 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 I got whacked. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm glad you were filming. Talk about making a turn. That was crazy. It has been a long journey to get here. Multiple weeks in the making, multiple cops getting arrested, and multiple plane flights, but we finally got this fire truck home. That tree whacked you pretty good. All right, after Matt whacking me in the head, I think it's time to end this episode of Carter's Life. 500 miles, new fire truck, 110 feet. Gotta fix this thing, and we're gonna be going straight up into the sky. I can't wait to show you guys. See you guys on the next vlog. Major shout out to Matt for driving 500 plus miles in a fire truck with a Team Rar shirt on. Alright, we'll see you guys in the next episode. I'm signing off. Peace. And I can't believe it, but made it back even for sunset. Beautiful way to end this episode of Carter's life. Gorgeous.